Welcome everyone uh, today. Uh, for those of you who do not know me, my name is Blair Bunmagura. I am the founder and executive director of the Art Song Preservation Society. Um, and uh, we welcome you today. This is our final virtual event of the spring season. Um, so thank you for joining uh, for this um, special occasion, having our one of our founding advisory board members, Thomas Grubb, uh, present a masterclass today in French song. Um, before we get started, uh, and before we welcome our guest artists, I would just like to uh, make you aware that while this is our last virtual event of the spring season, we'll take a little hiatus and then begin uh, a summer session of master classes under the uh, title Summer of Song. So if you're a singer or uh, interested, or if you're a uh, a voice teacher or a coach um, interested in having um, one of your students participate, please do not hesitate to reach out to me. I'm still looking for singers for the summer session. Um, and uh, th those classes will be announced at the end of the month. So you'll have an idea. Um, so you can check our website or social media or write to me personally. Um, I'd also like to thank uh, our um, donors today, both individual donations that have come in to make today possible. Thank you uh, for those of you who are making donations today. I'd like to say that no amount is too small or too big. So uh, whatever you have <laughs> helps us to, um, to bring in great artists uh, like we have today, Thomas Grubb, the other amazing advisory board members and guest teachers and uh, artists that teach our classes um, or do recitals. Um, so, in addition to those individual donations, I'd like to thank two of our larger funders, uh, both administered by LMCC, the Lower Manhattan Cultural uh, Community, um, and those funders are the Creative Engagement Grant, which is a wonderful grant that helps um, Manhattan-based projects, um, as well as um, the Upper Empowerment uh, Zone Corporation, UMZ. Uh, UMEZ, sorry, uh, and that that uh, specific grant is dedicated to arts organizations or artists who present um, uh, exhibitions or presentations or master classes on the Upper West Side of Manhattan. And that's important because you should know that before the pandemic, for those of you who are new to us, uh, our events took place at the Manhattan School of Music. Uh, on the Upper West Side of Manhattan. So um, the funders were, uh, they recognized that we're in a pandemic, so they were so gracious and allowed us to put all of our events online this year uh, until we can get past the pandemic. So we'll do that again this summer, we'll continue with virtual, and then probably after that, um, we'll transition back to our live events at the, uh, at the Manhattan School of Music, uh, where we're so proud to be able to partner with them and so thankful uh, for what they've been able to do. In fact, many of our singers and, um, and some of our, our wonderful guest artists and, and advisory board members, such as Thomas Morocco, um, teach us at uh, Manhattan And I School. used to, I used to. Yes, and, and many are our graduates. And I believe, Tom, you went to- I'm a graduate. Michigan. You're a graduate and a teacher from yeah. the Michigan. So we thank them so much for their um, um, collaboration and partnership. Uh, and the Upper Manhattan Empowerment Zone Development Corporation uh, is, um, uh, which is our, a support of this season, um, is the funder as well as the Creative Engagement Grant. And this has been made possible through New York City, um, the Department of Cultural Affairs. Uh, so thank you. Okay, with that, um, that is pretty much all of the housekeeping. Again, I'll ask you to remain muted. Um, each singer today, our wonderful singers, will have 30 minutes with our guest artists. Um, and, uh, and I'll be the timekeeper, which makes me terribly unpopular, but uh, <laughs> that, that is the way that ball bounces. So that with we me, you're through. needed, Blair, you know that. Yes, I will definitely give you a kind of a five minute heads up with each singer. Um, and you received the audience, both the singers and the audience received a lot of material for today. It's like a graduate level course. So you, in addition to um, the, um, the link for today, you should have received the translations, the French translations uh, or the French poems with the English translations. The preferred translations come from Pierre Bernac's book, The Interpretation of French uh, Song. And, um, and I know that uh, we'll get into this a little bit more um, with Thomas Grubb. This was his 
uh, uh, mentor and, and primary mentor. And um, when those songs weren't, if those songs are not in this book, I've used Graham Johnson's uh, French Song Companion for two songs. And, and the other book I'd like to just point out, while you don't have to have it today, is this is my copy, my singing oh, how beautiful. in French. And You've it's falling used it. apart. You've yes. used it. Mine's falling apart, for sure. But I yeah. keep it. It's special to me because, of course, I, it's uh, a signed copy. And, and we'll have to get you a new copy, Blair, because it, oh, you still have the flex record. I still have the, for the flip record. It's so, still in print, you know. It's still in print, so I highly recommend. Um, if Forty-two you're not, if, years. If you're a teacher and you're not using this book, if you're a teacher, uh, it's a wonderful, indispensable resource. Um, and singers, it's wonderful too because in the back there is a section that lists pretty much all the repertoire that exists. Um, and for each Fach, so if you're a singer looking for, I wonder what songs might be good for me, um, Thomas Grubb has them listed in here by Fach, so you can certainly People go to say that. Fach in French. Yes, there, there we go. Um, so I'm actually going to turn the, uh, the mic over to our guest artist today. Uh, his reputation certainly precedes him, so you, uh, without further ado, I give you Thomas Grubb. Thank you. Thank you, Blair. Is Phyllis, is Phyllis Sutherland? Is that Phyllis Brynjolfsson? Phyllis Brynjolfsson is here as well. Well, she's got her, she doesn't, is that not using her stage name? Yeah, there she, oh, okay, something blinked. And then Breton, Ble, Breton, some, is it Brown? His name is up there, but I don't see his picture. That doesn't mean anything, right? No, 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 they, they, they can hear you. Okay, good, let's go. Yes. So um, we've got wonderful singers. Uh, I, I won't, um, I believe you wanted to say something first before the singers start. No, but let's I, go. Uh, we, we need some music. Okay, let's, then uh, we have Samantha Burke singing Massenet's Elegie. And I will, uh, Samantha, uh, I have to find you. I believe I have, may have to unmute you. Oh, God. You. Let me just do that. Yes. Oh, this is, this is from Phyllis. Yes, it is Phyllis Bridges. Phyllis Bridges. Hello, Phyllis. Hello, Samantha. Hi, good afternoon, everyone. My name Hello is Samantha. You. Thank you, Mr. Grubb. How are you? I'm, I'm very well. I'm very hungry. <laughs> uh, me too. <laughs> <laughs> I'm excited to sing today. I'll be singing um, Massenet's Elegy. Um, and if you would like, I'm happy to start with the translation before I singing. Would like, I would like to do that. Fantastic. So, um, Samantha. Read it dramatically, that is to say, read it reflecting all the dynamic markings in the score. And if you want to use your score, please feel free at any moment to do so. Okay. Do it as you prepared it, and then we'll work from there. I don't want to throw you for a loop. I want you to feel comfortable. Oh, sweet spring of yesteryear. Sorry, wait a minute. What's the title? Elegy. Oh, that's important. Now we begin. Oh, sweet spring of yesteryear. Green seasons, you have fled forever. I no longer see the blue sky. I no longer hear the joyous songs of the birds. You have fled my love and with you has fled my happiness and in vain the spring returns for along with you the cheerful sun the laughing days have gone as my heart is dark and frozen all is withered forevermore samantha there's one correction i want to make the line en important mon bonheur you mm -hmm. see where i am Yes, I do. It's while taking away my happiness, oh beloved, you went away as well. It's a little different from what you read. All right, I'll mark that. I'll you see what that. I corrected? Yes, I do. And then withered, all is withered. Like withered. Withered. Yes. withered. No, it's with, like I go with you. Oh, I withered. That's right. It's a good English word. <laughs> you know what I mean? It's okay. Now, first of all, what is an elegy? 
An elegy is something that you is spoken um, when something or someone has died. It's a, it's a song or a, a expression of mourning, right? Yeah. That's what it really is. Um, can you tell me anything about Massenet in general? Was he a songwriter, essentially? Um, uh, not so much songs. This particular song was actually written for an opera, I believe. Or, That's true, it was. Yes, and so he was more of an operatic composer. He wrote um, 30 also, opera. He wrote 30 operas. That's not yeah. a little. Yes. He also wrote many, 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 many songs, but they didn't last. Only mm -hmm. this one. And um, what's the one I wrote down here? Ouvre tes yeux bleus. That's a very beautiful, you know that song? Yes, I've heard it before. A good tenor song. Mm -hmm. Now, he was also the teacher of Chausson. Do you know Ernest Chausson? Chausson, yes. And Reynald Lohan. Yes. And even Debussy was his student at the Conservatory of Paris. What kind of music, what nationality, nation really do you think of when you hear this song? I want to talk about it before you sing. What kind of nationality do I yeah, think what about? Flavor, what flavor? Is, it, it's not French, you know? This is, um, if I were to mix things, I would say this would be French. Oh. And Oh, a dramatic, but in a sense, it's very Russian. Also, yes, Russian, like it's yes, very Russian and very Tchaikovsky. Yes, isn't it? Right. Who weren't they at some point influenced? They're contemporaries. Yes, they're contemporaries. Okay, so let's go. You read the you read the translation. Let's sing. Now, how do you work this? thing with the piped in piano part? Um, well, I just Are enable you... my original sound and I have an external speaker that I'll use for the- Okay, you go uh, ahead and do your, you do your, you're, you're in control of it, right? Yes. You go ahead. Give her a hand.
Just you and me, Blair. <laughs> Everyone else is clapping to muted. Okay, okay. Now, Samantha. Yes, sir. We I can't see her anymore. Uh I I can there see you her. Are. Oh, I got you. I got you. Why do singers sing too slow? Why do singers always you you started you started with the pianist? By the way, the pianist has the right tempo, but you're behind the pianist. Okay. But that's what singers do, right? Yeah, we do. We tend to now, drag a little bit. Make that's okay, but you make it more difficult when you drag. Mm. There's just so much a voice of a pair of lungs can do when you want to sing full, you know? Yes. The second thing is, is the whole song in your score, is it all the same dynamic marking? No, it is not. Not at all, but there's so many places where it begins. For example, the song begins piano. Mm -hmm. Then a, a little bit of a swell on Verte Saison, but back to piano on Vous avez fait pour toujours. Then subito forte, je ne vois pas le ciel bleu. Then mezzo forte, okay. and then there's a crescendo beginning. Au oh, bien aimé, tu t'en es allé. Do you say tu t'en es allé? Tu t'en es allé. And do you say des oiseaux? Des oiseaux. I don't hear z. z. Des oiseaux. Don't stop it. De let it buzz. Des oiseaux. Des oiseaux. Don't go, de, de, don't bite it down. Des oiseaux. Des oiseaux. Don't let your tongue be too tight. So just des going oiseaux. through, then you have, hey, say ton vin. And then it says, diminuendo, que revient le printemps. Then subito forte. Oui, son retour avec toi. Le gai soleil, mezzo forte. Les jours lions sont partis. Fortissimo. Now you've got to save your biggest sound for... Comment mon cœur, tout est son égacé. But don't sit down when you sing louder. That's not nice to do to yourself. Okay. Because you're putting out more sound. What what makes sound louder in a singer? Uh, what makes more, your volume? More, more on the resonance and on the body. More of the, 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 the pressure. What makes a forte louder? There's more air pressure. Hey, more air <laughs> expenditure. Yes. But you see then what you don't want to do if it's louder is slow down. Mm, I see. You got to constantly check yourself. There's my metronome. I had a marking for this song. Now, of course, the pianist isn't here. <laughs> no. So we can't change. But let's see how I think he, she was doing pretty well because you were behind the pianist. It's 46 in the score. Okay. Where did I get that from? Who knows? Let's see what that is. That's pretty good. That's, it, says, it says at the beginning of the piece, what does it say for the tempo? Très long. That's all I have. You do. Say it again. Triste et très long. Well, that means slow and, you know what you want to think of is it? Yeah, da, da, dum, ba, two beats a bar, not four. Don't think, okay. so. don't go, oh, du pra, don't think of, oh, du pra, don. Like cut time, do you see what I mean? Yes, you say 46, would this be, if I played, I have two versions of this, um accompaniment There's so this is versions i know you this know. is a slower version so you're saying this one is a good idea but don't slow down for myself to think more into just stay with the pianist and you're fine don't get okay. behind the, you can hear the pianist can't yes, you i can so don't get behind that okay let's see I like I to turn it up just a little bit so i can hear all the way i want to correct this in the french mm -hmm. uh du printemps do, do is closed do. Do. No, do. Do. Do, re, mi, fa. Do, do. 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 Do
do. Okie dokie. Okie dokie. Do. No, Betty White. Betty White. Okie dokie. Okie dokie. Minnesota. <laughs> Minnesota. 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 Soda. Minnesota. Make fun of me. Soda. Soda. You're not owing enough. Do to the French way to close the O and oh. open O. And they're very different. O. O. Make your lips, muscle your lips. O. Yeah, it's not a high note. And then O. Example. Okay. Bonner. 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 Bo. Bo. Bonner. Keep your mouth open for nerd. Bonner. Bonner. There you go. Okay. What else I have? Des oiseaux. Now you're not paying attention to your low voice. Your low voice needs to be as resonant. This piece, what key are you in? E minor or F? F minor. You're in F. Okay, well, you're in the higher key, but you 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 really the lowest note. Is it is in the F minor would be a C sharp, right? A C natural, correct. A C natural. Yes, you're right. So you got to be careful because that's only piano, but when you have to go down lower, you lose your resonance. You want to keep it, keep thinking about anything below the staff. Stay, stay, keep pay attention. Singers tend to lose interest when it goes low. Okay. We're interested in all of your voice, right? Correct. As now am I. Let's, <laughs> let's try to observe the dynamic markings. Let's motivate them. The song is a little dreary, not that it should be anything but anything happy or hippy hoppy, but it's got to be moving. And if it's all the same sound, you see, you know people like that, they talk like this and they never change the tune. Yeah. tune them out right That's, that is true <laughs> oh boy i know you don't want to be tuned out <laughs> no you don't so make us wait for changes in your sound and your intensity show us the gentle mournful side of your sadness as opposed to the desperate because somebody has left what has died a love a relationship That's right it's the death of a love perhaps one of the worst deaths that we maybe experienced in our lifetimes, because it's not really, any, it's not something you, it's just something that's gone from your life and it's, it's no longer there as well as the presence. Okay, let's get the pianist to start you again. Okay. Oh, sorry. And that high note. Don't sit up there like that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Keep going. Mm, it's it. Longer, but we don't care about it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I get it. But and it doesn't begin forte. Don't begin forte. It begins piano. Am I right? Yes, you are. You are. Okay, let's start again. score you're, you're you're lost in your singer world i've got to get you back to the real world now you okay. got your score in front of you yes i have it right here have you got piano at the beginning of odu Pantan? i have pianissimo and oh, oh wow then do you have mezzo forte and verte saison yes i do oh wow they sounded the same 
Even What's that going to do? It's going to make us listen more closely if you don't give us all of your voice. What is au doux printemps d'autres fois? What does that mean? Oh, sweet spring of yesteryear. And what is the feeling behind that statement? It's so bitter. It's a bitter, bitter nostalgia. Nostalgia. Sorry. Bitter nostalgia. What's sadja? No, uh, nostalgia, like to remember. Nostalgia. Something. Yeah. Exactly. Is nostalgia dramatic? It can be at points. It, think about it. When you're nostalgic, are you in a dramatic frame of mind or just a little wistful? I think I can be wistful at points, yes. Yeah. Oh, sweet spring of yesteryear. Then a little more intensity, green seasons. And then sadder, you fled forever. Mm. Show us the different degrees of volume and strength and resonance of your voice. Don't just sing in one pressure, you know? Yes. Okay. I'll try to make those differences more. Look at your score closely as you sing now. You know, we get away from the score too quickly. I think it's because we're, we're encouraged to memorize always before we really know the score. You know the expression to know the score in real yeah. life and in music? Well, you got to know the score. Right. Before you start to memorize. So don't keep looking at it right now. And don't get away from it. Keep It's in front of you, right? Yeah. Um, yes. Right Can't now. you put it in front of you? Where you can see it easily? Yes, I can see it. Good. Let's go. Look at me. Yes. Oh, I know we have to go back, don't we? We can't stop like that. I know. Let's, let's forget the pianos. Okay. Do you mind? I no. Want to, I want to begin on Je ne vois pas. Don't get too spread. Don't spread. Je. Look at me. Mm. Don't yes. over. Don't over open. Je. Look at my mouth. Sure. Don't go oh uh, like that. Uh 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 yeah. yeah, more focused vowel. Okay. Because that's only an F natural, right? Yes. It's not a high note. No, it's not. Let's I have one question. Oh sorry. What? What? My question is uh I have the line just to make sure that my score is saying the same as yours. I have je ne vois le ciel bleu. I see. I in the score that I had, it says pas le ciel bleu, and then je n'entends plus. Okay. So I don't see the the blue sky. I no longer hear. Okay. It makes better poetry. Okay, so I'll make that pas. Yeah, I think pas is a better word. Yeah, and sit on the word pas a little bit. Okay. Let's begin. Okay. Vous m'avez fui. Vous avez fui. Vous avez fui pour toujours. I'm in yeah. the wrong. <laughs> but what are you going to say? Well, they sound the same dynamic. And vous avez fui pour toujours. You don't ever sing piano. You need to sing piano and then we hear we, you don't have to push to sing forte you see what i mean yes 
you got the let, you got to let back with the, the volume to make the, the contrast. You all, all, otherwise you're just always doing <laughs> loud. I, I'm, sorry. I'm sorry. No, that's okay. You're fine. You're fine. I want you to. I want you to forget yourself. Forget me. Forget everything. Think about the music. Vous avez fui. phrase if you didn't slow down. You're right not to breathe. You shouldn't breathe on that phrase. Okay. But if you but, slow down, th the last time you took a breath between Sean and Joyeux. Make it through. I can make it through. You could. Uh, begin, je n'entends plus les chants. Je n'entends plus that's, that's, forte. That, that's forte. It's not Mark Forte. Okay, even less. Je plus oh. There you go. Come on. Oh, no. mm, I'm in the wrong key, but. Oh, oh. No. Hey, hey, did it say to sing that louder? En emportant mon bonheur? No, the crescent is on the old bien aimé. Back in, full voiced. And it ended up in a, in a diminuendo, right? Uh -huh. Not really. It ended up in a mezzo forte. But don't begin in the full. You see, if you, if you sing loud all the time, you have no chance of making any variety of sound. And after a while, you're singing at us, right. not to us. You must sing to us. You see? So you, you want to draw. You know, it's always better to just do a little less than you. Don't give, that, don't give it all away hmm. all the time. Keep a little for yourself. And then when you want to make a difference and really sing out, you've got a reserve to come out with, you know, Other, otherwise it's too loud. You're yelling at us and we don't, we want to hear contrast. Let's begin. Oh, je n'entends plus. Yeah. Okay. And that crescendo on uh, after what this was all, you want maybe like a tip. I have mezzo forte, je n'entends plus. And then yes. I have piano. Les chants joyeux des oiseaux. And do you have a crescendo after that or not? Only in the piano part. I have a crescendo, okay. No, um, not in my, I had, I, I copied the, you know what I, I actually did? I couldn't find my score in my library because it's all a mess. So I, I went online and I, look. I, you wrote it all out, oh my God, by hand. <laughs> It took me, it didn't take me long. It's just full of mistakes. But I really copied them dynamics down. It was a good edition. Okay. So go online and check your, your score out. There's, there were 45 different scores in this song. Yes, there were. But I think it was a good place that I found this one. It was the, you first, know, it was the first one. Sorry? Do you know by chance which? Uh, addition or which? Uh, Sorry, I, I can let you know. It was the first one I clicked on. Okay. And then I compared the other. Let's begin en emportant. No, wait a minute. I don't mean that. Je n'entends plus les chants des oiseaux. No, let's not begin there. Let's begin en emportant mon bonheur, which begins piano. Okay. Okay, without the crescendo, just to be clear. No crescendo except in the piano part. Okay. All right, and do you have a question at O bien aimé? Just so that yes, I do. Okay. Yes, I do. To the forte of a c'est en vain. Okay. I'm sorry to cut in. I just want to let you know five minutes. 
we're going to just finish this section. Okay. Because we, I think I've gotten the point across. Samantha. Yeah. Sir. Can I, Samantha, you love your voice and so do we. But we, you got to love the music and the and the composer's work, and you got to make it something special for us. And you have too much fun. I see. A little less. Less is and more. You understand what I mean? It's not bad to have fun, but you got to have fun imagining different sounds. You think of good singers of songs and of opera. They mm -hmm. have many sounds. They vary their delivery, their energy, their, their, their power. Okay? Let's begin. En emportant mon bonheur, which begins piano. All right. Don't stop looking at your score. You backed away. I'm looking, I promise. Okay, okay. <laughs> Don't get lost in yourself again. We stay I'm stay not. with me. I'm right here. I'm right here. You know, we've always got to be in two different places when we perform. We're exteriorizing our feelings always. But something inside of us is always registering what we're doing and keeping track. You've got yes. to do both. It's two different pl planes. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Uh, it sounds like a department store. Yeah, I'm right in front of my door. If you could, I just have one second and then I'll sing. Thank you. We're going to just finish up with En Emportant. What was that, a doorbell? <laughs> That's the thing with virtual stuff, you know? Yes, the, the, the things you can't plan. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, Samantha. Samantha, dear. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm going to stop with you now because Blair asked me, he said we've gone over our time. I want you to tell me what we worked on most today. So what I've gathered um, mostly, um, there were a few corrections in my French. I think I have to work on my- Not a lot, not a lot. Your That's French okay. is pretty decent. What did I correct you the most about? The dynamics and really pulling more on the on the way of my pianos, my pianissimos, and just varying the the change between my soft singing, my um, mezzo forte singing, mezzo piano singing, and my true forte singing. Um, what, what you, sorry, what you've got to do is link up the meaning of the text because the music is pretty much the same all the time in a, in a certain way. It moves in the same way, but you've got to link what you feel the text wants when you sing, oh, sweet sp spring of your, you don't want to scream. Right. You see what I mean? But when you go, as in my heart, everything is dark and frozen, that's marked fortissimo in my score. Yes. You see? So you want to have a breadth of dynamic change and variety. And, and don't and be like the, to the text. Don't be like the person that talks. You know, those people, they're terrible. They scream <laughs> at you all the time. You don't yeah. really scream, but you're lovely to work with. I enjoyed that very much. Thank you. Work hard, Thank okay? You. I will. Thank you. I think I've learned I quite a lot. I how old you are, but you can tell Blair. To tell me later. Okay. I'm in my 20s. That's what I thought. And that gives me hope. <laughs> me too. Thank you so much. You're so welcome. Take care. Right. Goodbye. Thank you. thank you, Samantha. Uh, thank you for the beautiful work today. And next up, we have. Oh, by the way, Tom, I just wanted to point out, because I know having obviously attended many of your classes before, that you um, have singers. Uh, when they're reciting the poem, do it in their native tongue. Yes. And, and her native tongue is Spanish, just oh. so you're aware. Samantha, hers? Yes. Oh, I should have, she should have done it in Spanish. And that might have influenced uh, the inflection of the, of, uh, the connection for her. That's but why. She doesn't speak with an accent in English, so 
I had no way of knowing that she spoke Spanish. Yeah, yeah. So uh, I just wanted to uh, point out, singers, uh, be aware. Uh, if you if your native um, language isn't English, uh, you may please make that point across uh, known to um, Mr. Grubb, and that way he can uh, adjust. What's, what's the next piece? Après un rêve. Uh, après un rêve. Okay, a tenor. Yes, uh, Alonso, uh, Jordan Lopez, and uh, let's make sure Alonso's here. Oh. Hello. Hello, Alonso. What is your native tongue? I would say English at this point. Very good. Let's see. We have Après un rêve. Let's read the text in English. But remember, you want to reflect the setting in the score all the dynamic changes, et cetera, et cetera. So it's not just a rattling off the poem in English. You're thinking of the performance, okay? Yes, sir. Anytime you're ready. First of all, the title. <clears throat> After a dream. In a sleep made sweet by- You've got to project. You're too, you're, you're too far away. Can you come closer to the microphone? Here, let me see. Is that better? Yeah, don't, don't back up. Okay. Oh, that's much better. Much better. Can you- No, 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 don't go back. Okay. Here I am. Is that better? Much. Okay. <laughs> that way you don't have to speak so loudly, but you can, you can be heard. After a dream, go ahead. After a dream. In a sleep made sweet by a vision of you. I dreamed of happiness, passionate illusion. Your eyes were more tender, your voice pure and ringing. Is there a crescendo there? No. No. You got all excited. Yes. You said pure and what? Ringing. I want you to go back to tes yeux. Okay. Your eyes were more tender, your voice pure and ringing. Right. You shone like a sky lighted by the dawn. Now, excuse me, is any of that forte? Any of that verse? No. What is it marked immediately at the beginning over Dans un sommeil? What does it say? Uh, dolce which means sweetly no not, oh. in, not in music that's dolce as when when you want your coffee sweet <laughs> um, music dolce and forte mean um dolce in forte dolce means forte means what do they two both mean opposites oh yeah soft and then loud yes don't yes. say sweet. How do you sweet? You, that's, that's very hard to do is sweet <laughs> without being nauseous about it or nauseating. <laughs> do you know what I mean? Yeah. You're soft. So the whole verse, oh, I'm, I'm losing my, my I, I lost your name. Alonso. Alonso, Alonso. Alonso. A, I love that name. Thank you. It's a great name. Alonso then what? Jordan Lopez, Jordan Lopez. Jordan, well, yes. that's a great name, hyphenated. <laughs> I love to hyphen. I will, I'll take note of that. People, people will say the whole thing because it really goes well. <laughs> Alonso Jordan, the whole verse is in a dolce mm -hmm. because tu m'appelais, what do you think the dynamic will be of that verse? Look at the score. Well, it goes into forte. Immediately. Loud. Yes. With a crescendo. So that's going to begin louder on the words, tu m'appelais, which means you calling, you were calling me, right? Mm -hmm. Forte, right away, on tu m'appelais. So that's the loud verse, louder. The next verse, les cieux. Piano, soft. Oh, okay. Now we're getting somewhere with a crescendo to a big forte on the high G, a loss. Mm -hmm. Now we're back to 
hélas triste réveil des songes, which will stay, which will stay full of voice. Then, all nuit, what will the dynamic be there? I have nothing marked new in my score. Oh, no, we don't. So forte. Je t'appelle, what does it mark? Uh, mezzo forte. There you go. So not quite as loud. And now we have the big crescendo to radieuse, diminuendo, piano revient, mm -hmm. oh nuit mystérieuse, pianissimo. How many things there are in a score? There's so much to see. Mm -hmm. You know, it, you just never get tired of it. That's why during your whole life, when you work on the same piece, you say, oh, I never saw that before. Look at that. That's what makes it fun. Let's begin again. In a sleep, yeah. dolce. What are you doing here when you begin this? What's happening? I'm recounting this no, memory of this. Happening? It says after a dream. So what's so, happening? Waking up. You're waking up and remembering. Yes. You're not really fully awake. Mm -hmm. You don't really wake up entirely until a loss. Mm -hmm. When you realize that the dream is a dream. Mm -hmm. Did that ever happen to you? You think, oh, what a good dream. I want to stay in that dream. I don't want to get out of that dream. And then you wake up and say, hey, I want that dream back. <laughs> I want to get back. Where'd they leave off? And you try to fall asleep again? Did you ever do that? Oh, yes. You see, it's very human. I'm having trouble hearing you. Tom, I think you're muted again. Let me see if I can unmute you. There you go. How crazy is that? <laughs> okay. You have to realize that you're coming out of a dream. Dans un sommeil que Charles met ton image. Je rêvais. I dreamt of happiness. Burning. Burning. You said something else. Ardent means burning. Mm -hmm. Illusion. Mirage. Your your eyes were, were were more gentle. What did you say? Tender. I think gentle is a better word for do. Mm -hmm. Voice pure and and, and ringing, then a little a little more sound. You beamed. You shone like a sky lit up by the dawn. A bar of rest, and then come in with more sound. Mm -hmm. Let's begin with "Tu m'appelais." Okay. You called me, and I left the earth to fly with you towards the light. Does it say soft, softer there? No. Pour m'enfuir, does it say softer? Uh, pour m'enfuir, no. No, only on lumière. Okay. I'm just reading the score. I'm not yes. clever. You got to be just as, you know, observant. Mm -hmm. Tu m'appelais again. You called me and I left the earth to fly with you towards the light. Good. Now, piano. Shh. The skies drew apart their clouds oh, don't, for don't, us. Don't lose your present. Okay. The skies drew apart their clouds for us. Unknown splendors. Glimpses of divine fires. Alas! Alas! Sad awakening from dreams. I invoke you, O oh night. Give me back your illusions. Return, return in radiance. Return, oh mysterious night. Uh, I think you're muted again, Mr. Grubb. Okay, I got rid of it, but I didn't do anything. Anyway, you read it very well. Am I getting through to you what I want you to think of doing more? Yes. When you read the translation 
think of the music. Mm -hmm. It's words and music. Mm -hmm. What is what is your heritage? Where are your where's your family from? Mexico, Mexican. I yes. knew it. You look Mexican. Thanks. <laughs> That's a wonderful answer. That's great. You know you do, right? Yes. I embrace it. <laughs> well, why not? <laughs> Let's get Mistress Madame Pianist to begin. Okay. Yes, our pianist will be app companist today. Sorry? <laughs> I just said our pianist will be an app today. I see, an app. Yes. Thank you. Let's give him a hand. Good for you. Thank you. Everybody give him a hand. <laughs> Blair is clapping. <laughs> All right, Alonso Jordan. I like that name. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, how nice. Samantha says bravo. Thank you, Samantha. <laughs> you too. Now, this song lies a little low for you. <laughs> and you're singing full throttle. You can't get louder than you are. You're pushing. <laughs> Don't corner yourself like that as a singer. Don't give all you've got. You know the old story. You give all you got all the time. There's nowhere to go. <laughs> totally. Save your, save your full voice for where it says forte. <laughs> and other times... Find another sound. You don't, you know, when, when you talk normally, can you hear me? When you talk normally, you don't always talk the same way, right? Yes. Yeah. It'd be horrible if you did. But singers get into their little place and they sing in that same sound. I talked to Samantha about that. Next thing I want to correct is the triple, triple, triple. Yeah, da, 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 
di da di da di triple it triple it na da da bam ba da bam don't jerk them around sing through sing each note fully however short <clears throat> give it its full resonance but don't cheat the, the duration of each triplet mm -hmm. splendeur zin connu i didn't hear that liaison okay i'm in the third page of the song or you hear what i mean yes and then after je t'appelle get a good breath you okay. didn't get a good breath you you made a space but you didn't breathe at all did you do that on purpose no <laughs> je t'appelle breath oh nuit no yes je t'appelle oh nuit en moi then you got all slow on revient, which is suicide. Mm -hmm. Revient, breath. Re move this. Get to the top. And then it's not subito piano, it's revient. Not subito soft. You see the crescendo, the mini window goes into re. But the piano in my score is over viens. Yes. You got suddenly softer. You've got to be your best, your own best friend. And watch out, cover yourself. Don't paint yourself into corners that you don't have any breath left or that you're too loud and you don't have enough gas. Mm -hmm. That's your responsibility as a performer. Got to watch out for yourself. Nobody else is going to do it. You've watched singers do that on stage, haven't you? They strangle themselves. And you feel sorry for them, but you say, hey, save your life, save your own life. <laughs> okay, you know we got a chopper for a pianist here. <laughs> You're chopping wood. Cha, 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 cha. I would ask the pianist if he were alive, <laughs> but not even pick his hand off the keyboard that stay in the keyboard. So it's wah, 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 chunk, 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 chunk. You understand? Yeah. It's more like a string player. You're always on the string, but you're changing the bow. So don't listen to him, her. He's making you sing too heavily. Mm -hmm. After a dream. Let's begin again. Okay. Okay, stop. Dans un sommeil. You're not going to breathe, right? So, me que cha, me, me que charme, me que charme, Tony, na, me que charme. Mm -hmm. You started well, but don't lose your presence in the piano. Mm -hmm. Stay in the intensity of the piano. Okay. Don't go away from us in the in the piano. I'm gonna let you, I'm gonna try to let you go further this time. I'm not gonna stop you for the same reason. So try to do that. Let's begin again. Okay. I'm learning how to do this. <laughs> I've never done this before. Gosh. I'm sorry. Ah. I know. I got it. <laughs> ah. Especially in the low voice. You can't sing French with ah all the time. You sound like, I won't say, you sound like an, another person that speaks French, but not like a French person. 
You have an accent. Ah, OK. Sauvez, vous sauvez. Il parle comme ça. Il parle comme ça. Ah, ah, ah. You speak Spanish a little bit? Si. Hablo Good. espanol. Ah, ah. No, no, it's not ah. Uh, it's ah. Oh, OK. <laughs> Adios. Adios. Ah. Ah. España. Ah. España. España. Ah. Mm -hmm. Not ah. And not all. Uh -huh. That's the Queen of England. <laughs> okay. You understand what I mean? It doesn't yes. sound French at all. Let's never mind with the pianist. Okay. Can you do it without the piano? Yeah. You're driving me crazy. <laughs> Where do you want me to start from? The beginning. Okay. I want you to get que charme ton image. Je rêvais le bonheur ardent, mirage, age, 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 in the face, in the face, okay. in the mask. Good you, good for you. I have a piano. Dans un sommet que charme ton... Don't let consonants stop you. Okay. Don't bite the consonants. No double M. So Half an M. So The higher you sing, the less you articulate the words. The less not stop, but don't art don't start saying the words up in the top voice. Dans un sommeil. Dans un sommeil. Okay, you have, me. have you got a mirror on the in back of you? Have you got a mirror somewhere? I do. It's right here. <laughs> I want you but to yes. watch your jaw. You do this. Okay. Look. I want to see this. Don't chew with your teeth. Okay. Watch yourself. Don't stop for the consonant. It's the consonant in French is rapid, safely rapid. Rapid. Late. Late. And clear. Clear. So say the consonant quickly. Don't anticipate it and stop the vowel. Can you sing? Oh, without the consonants for a second. Oh, your jaw. Look at yourself in the mirror. Your jaw is still moving. You see, you see your jaw? Yeah, I see it. Did you see, I see your it. jaw move? Uh -huh. You don't need your jaw. You got vowels going on here. Mm -hmm. The jaw is a hinge, right? Yeah. Hang it. Look, stupid. Look, stupid. I didn't call you stupid. I want you to look at the stupid look on my face. That's all you want to look. Like you're not really, you're not too smart uh -huh. when you sing. Don't, don't be one of those singers that over articulates, <laughs> singing with diction. You know what I mean. It's <laughs> annoying. Do, so, so, me. Half consonants. Go. Don't stop it. I'm turning. I'm singing F's today. <laughs> I don't sing F's. I should. And I, I shouldn't try to sing. Dans un sommeil again. We may not get over more than the first verse. I don't care. I want to get this idea of legato. Okay. Long vowel, say with me, long vowel. Long vowel. Think about what that means. What kind of consonants, three words. Um, late. What's the short. first one? R, L, and, um, and C. C, okay. Rapid, late, and clear. Rapid, late, clear. 
What's the vowel going to be? Long. Write that down. No, write, go ahead. Keep writing yeah. RLC. I want you to write that down. So the mantra is long vowel. Long vowels. Then what? Rapid, late, clear, clear consonant. Rapid, late, and clear. And cl rapid, late, and clear. It's not to say the consonants aren't important, but they're not voice. What does consonare mean? Consonare? Yeah, what does that really mean? I want to say it means like with uh, sound. Uh, no, it's cons sonare con. Yeah. The sound with. Sound with. What is this consonant sound with? With the. The consonant. Sounds with the vowel. Vowel. Okay. Sorry. <laughs> you see what I mean? Yeah. You want to try to think of putting the long vowel goes right into the consonant and then boom. So you think of this of a scar of pulling scarves out of your mouth. Yeah. They're all different colors, and when they change color, they're a different vowel. Not that your voice can change color, but just to indicate. But there's no stop. There's no, they're all connected. Mm -hmm. So that you have the idea of continual sound and not biting the, the consonants and biting off the, the legato. I'm sorry, Tom. We have five minutes. Oh, God. That's terrible. Well, we're going to finish this phrase. Okay. You know, if I can get one point across a singer and they do something well with it, I feel satisfied. I hope you will. Yes. Don't I... Okay. 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 But but that doesn't mean sing the whole piece slower. It's yada yada What is the tempo marking? Ah, andantino. What does that mean? Um, a little slower than walking pace. You know, there's disagreement about this. Does it mean a little slower or a little faster? Oh, yeah, that's true. I like it. I think andante is a moving tempo. Uh -huh. So andantino could mean not so slow, but more moving than andante. That way you could, it chung, chung, chung. The piano is a little slow. Here's, here's my tempo. My tempo is Mr. Belknock's tempo which is, you're going to be surprised. It's 60. Chung, 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 Go ahead. I didn't have that Don't slow down on the triplets. You like to slow down on the F. You do that. Okay. Lighten up the second F. And go. Yapojatura. No, don't. You're chopping. You sound angry. You getting angry? No. Good. <laughs> say, say for me, don. 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 Not don. Don the so. Don the so. So. Don the so. Don't use your nose. Don't sing in your nose. Dans a saw. 
Don't so. No, don't think. No, don't do that. You're using your nose. Don't let your nose get in the act. Look, it's going to be here and here. Oral pharyngeal. The nasal in French is added pharyngeal resonance, upper pharyngeal. It's not like that. You see what I mean? It's oh, oh, do with me. Oh, oh. Brand your lips. Brand your lips. Oh, oh. Come on. Oh, oh. Let the let the sound go up and up and, and back. Oh, oh. You're in your nose. Oh, listen. Oh. 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 That's better. You want more here? Oh, oh. Round, round. Oh, oh. You see the rounder, if you round your lips slightly, not don't close them, round them slightly, you get more a cup of resonance around the vowel and it flips into your pharyngeal cavity, upper pharyngeal cavity. That's what you want more of. And the first two words of this song are nasalized, which is a misnomer. They should be nasal pharyngealized. You understand me? Draws a somme. Again, don't. Dans un sommeil que charme ton image. Je révèle le bonheur à dormir. Ardon. Start there. Ard. I do declare. Make fun of me. I do declare. I do declare. Here you go. Not okay. I do declare. I do. Ah. 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 I do. Ah. 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 Ardo. Ardo. Mira. Ardo. Ardo. Mira. So every dark A nasal, like Ardon, think of it as open O nasal. Okay. Ardon mi ra. And ar and ra must match. Ardon. Ardon. Ah, ah, ah. ah. Sing, it, ah. sing in your, in your, in your ah. eyes, in your mask, your mask. Ardon mi ra. Ardon. Oh. Ardo mirage. You're going to promise me as you work on this piece more, you're going to get the kinks out of the triplets. Yeah. They're all jerky. Ardo mirage. It had to be even. Now, ah, ah, ah. Mm -hmm. you don't want them to be sticky and, and rough. Mm -hmm. I think we have to stop. I don't want to get Blair upset today. I always go too long. You work very well. I would much rather, I would much prefer work to work with you privately and we wouldn't have the glare of the crowd. And also we could work longer. Wonderful. That's Thank what you. I'd like. Okay. Thank you so much. Well, um, Alonso is not too far from you, Tom. So I'm sure we can make that happen. Where is he? New York. Oh, where? Uh, Lower East Side. That's pretty far. I'm up as oh. Upper West Side, but that's okay. You can get here. Uh, it's fine. I used to live in the Upper West Side, so. Okay, that's good. Nice to work with you. Okay, you too. Thank you. Great. Bye bye. Thank you, Alonzo. And moving on uh, to Sydney. Uh, Sydney Branch will be singing Kutan. Um, Sydney, I'll unmute you. Hopefully, you're unmuted yep. now. Hello. Oh, Sydney's the gal. I never know with Sydney. But <laughs> yeah. You get that a lot, right? Yeah. You're tired of it. Is it S I D? It's um, like Australia, S Y D. Yeah. Okay. But you're not from Australia. No. That's good. Yeah. I have nothing against Australians. Oton. Okay, now this is another 
this is, this is different from Après un rêve. Faure wrote only three or four full lyric dramatics of songs. This is one of them. It's a dark song with spots, flashes of sunlight along the way, right? Mm -hmm. But it starts, autumn is of course, when when darkness, the light starts to stop and the skies become navrant and navrant. Let me find my, my score, uh, autumn 12. Sydney, where are you from? I'm in Hawaii right now. Oh, you're in Hawaii. You know, that's the best thing about the stuff is we never know where anybody, it seems like you're from the same places as um, all I can remember is Alonso, yeah. But you, you, you live in Hawaii, right? Yes. Are you Hawaiian? No, I'm, I was born in California. That's okay. <laughs> <laughs> Let's read the text. Autumn. Autumn of misty skies. The okay, heart. Now, you're lo are you looking? Where are you looking? Yes. Right here. Well, what, does, what does the dynamic say? Forte. Oh. <laughs> I hope that's not your forte. No, there can be more forte. Okay. No, but it gets it gets so, it gets louder and softer. Mm -hmm. So let's think of this as the opening full voice. Okay. Go. Autumn of misty skies, the heartbreaking horizons, the rapid sunsets and pale dawns. I watched flowing on like the waters of the torrent, your days imbued with melancholy. Now, it's a little introverted. I want you to be more of an actress. Okay. It's more dramatic. Okay. Autumn with its misty skies and its heart-rending horizons. With its sempre forte, it says, right? Mm -hmm. Don't lose your energy. With its rapid sunsets and its pale dawns, I look, I watch flow like the water of the torrent, your days made no diminuendo yet okay look at the score right mm -hmm. your days made here's the diminuendo on of melancholy okay yeah give me more energy give me more sound okay autumn of the misty skies the heartbreaking horizons the you're, rapid sunsets you're too, you're too peaceful too peaceful okay <laughs> oh this is the season when I get blue and gloomy. Okay. Autumn with your go. Autumn with no, the mist. That's the same thing. You're going like this. I'm not making fun of you. Autumn with your, you know, make me feel what you feel about autumn. How do you okay. feel? It says forte immediately. Okay. Autumn of misty it's skies. Ah, oh, it's the same. Thing. It's something that's got to come from within you. Okay. You know, this is the way to work on, on interpretation without the duress of singing. When singers check out. Have you ever noticed? They walk on stage. Hello, my name is so-and-so, and I'm going to sing da-da-da-da. They go. They become a deer in headlights. Don't do the deer thing. Okay. Stay with me. Okay. Go. Autumn of the misty skies, the heartbreaking horizons, the rapid sunsets and the pale dawns. I watched flowing on like the waters of the torrent, your days imbued with melancholy. Okay, th I'm not going to make you do that again because we've done it a couple of times. But you don't give me another aspect of yourself. I know that you know how to get really depressed or really mad. Am I wrong? No. But do you get mad like this? Do you do that when you're mad? No. That's good. I don't think you do. Continue now. You're going to go on. Um, it says, sur l'aile, right around that. Now what does it say? My thoughts born now, away. What, what, is, what does it say for dynamic? Oh, sorry. It's dolce piano. Now it's soft. My thoughts borne away on the wings of regret, as though it were possible. Don't to mumble uh. when it's softer. 
you want to enunciate better okay on the wing of regret my okay yeah my thoughts borne away on the wing of regret as where, though it were where do you get thoughts oh i have my thoughts is it something else i have the word That's thoughts cool. here on the wing of regret my spirit oh, is spirit. carried okay. away there's no pensée here okay where did you get your, your translation um i have from the is it the the interpretation of french song you really yes is that what he's got this always happens to me quickly i'm looking it up Quickly, I said, quickly, quickly. Here we go. Autumn of misty skies, the rapid sunsets, the pale dawns. I watch flowing my thoughts. Oh, you're not wrong. You know that Pierre Bernard did not do the translations. A nice English lady did them for him. And she's very, very English, you know. She's like a cup of tea. <laughs> And sometimes they, they're not offensive and, you know, a little gutsy. Mm -hmm. And they may, they turn the translations into something kind of genteel. That's far into the French character, really. As false as they can be in society, they're not a genteel people. You know any French people? Uh, no. That's okay. You will. <laughs> okay. Should I change it to spirit? Let's say... In order of the French, on the wing of regret, my spirit, my um, spirits carried away, are carried away, as though then it can go on. Okay. On the wing of regret, my spirits are carried away, as though it were possible for our time to come again are wandering in dreams on the enchanted hillside where the days of my youth once smiled. Now, in that small space of time, we were supposed to have gone from a dolce to a forte. Okay, even more. But, I'm sorry, I didn't concentrate on your name. Sydney. Of course. Come on. S-Y-D. Look at the score. Mm -hmm. On the wing of regrets, my spirits carried away, as if it were possible that our time be reborn. Reborn, okay. Renaissance, Renaissance is a re rebirth. Okay. Now crescendo begins. Um, wanders dreamily, the wandering dreamily the enchanted hillsides where formerly, that's the important word, where formerly smiled, sempre forte, my youth. Now you're probably no more than 20 something, right? Yeah, I'm 28. Oh, you're an old lady. <laughs> no, but you don't have to be so, you're, you're very contained. I want you to let go a little bit. In other words, you got to break the eggs to make the omelet, right? Mm -hmm. You can't put them into the pan with the shell on. Okay. Break an egg. Break a plate. You know what okay. does, does you good once in a while? You know what's good to do? Go in the back of the backyard and throw plates against the barn door. Break them. <laughs> yeah, and get some of that inside of you outside. Okay. Because you chose a song that's not typically foray. It's got a lot of drama in it. Um, let's go on. Je sens au clair soleil. Okay. In the clear sun of victorious memory, the scent comes to me of fallen roses flowering once more in clusters. Now, is this sad? Um, yeah, it's... Mm. It's... It's... Uh, it's a happy sad, like it's it's hurtful to think about this happiness. Compared to the beginning. Yeah, oh, compared to the beginning, it's a little more happier. It's happier. Yeah. You were getting a little morose there. Okay, happier. 
don't use emotion without thought, without without meaning to. Don't okay. use it for nothing. Try to use it. You say, I feel, where am I? Je sens. I feel in the bright sun of vanquishing re memory, re-blossom into bouquets, the roses, the cut roses. And tears come to my, now here's where the drama comes. But begin the verse with a certain happiness. Okay. In the clear sun of victorious memory, the scent comes to me of fallen roses flowering once more in clusters. And tears come to my eyes that in my heart at oh, 20. Minute, you're getting way ahead of me. Look oh. at this four. You're not changing anything. This is the third singer I have. I'm saying the same thing to all of you. So you're not alone. I feel in the bright sun of vanquishing memory. Less piano means mezzo forte? More loud. More loud. Okay. Blossoming in, in a bouquet, the cut roses. Crescendo. And to ascend uh, to my eyes, the tears, here is where we're going to start the crescendo, to the forte of my 20 years. Don't you see? Yes. I'm just showing you, pointing out what the composer already pointed out, but you didn't see that, or you're not reflecting it to me. Why are we doing this? We spend a lot of time on the reading. Why do I do that? Some people get annoyed with me when I do that in a class. Why am I doing it? It's to reflect the song, to re reflect the music. The what of the song? The emotion. Well, the, the emotions are not in the score, they're in the dynamics, mm -hmm. which, you, which get you started to reflect the emotions. But if you just keep the same dynamic of sound and attitude and energy, nothing going on, nothing's happening. Go back, I feel piano. In the clear sun of victorious- Begin, I feel. I, I feel the clear sun, a victorious memory. The scent I feel in the clear, clear sun. Oh, okay. I feel in the clear sun, a victorious memory. The scent comes to me of fallen less, roses. Less soft. Less. less soft. Oh, okay. I feel in the clear sun, a victorious memory. The scent comes to me of fallen roses flowering here. once more. Now here you go. And in and in tears come to my eyes that in my heart at 20 no, had forgotten. But get, let it get broader. broader. My 20 years had forgotten. At 20, uh, at 20 years had forgotten. You've never done this before, have you? Uh, not really, no. You see, I think that American students, um, at least in conservatories or in music departments, they're taught to sing correctly, maybe, hopefully or in time, hopefully, but they're not taught to tap in to their emotions. I don't think it's something that is well taught in our country. I think it's kind of un-American. Don't you think cool's American? <laughs> yeah, they, um, they focus like cool more on that. Yeah. <laughs> so my students used to say, Mr. Grubb, you're really cool. And I say, don't you dare call me that. <laughs> I'm not cool. Not at all. My best friends will tell you that. You've got to got to get out of yourself. You're very young, but that doesn't excuse you. You just have to get used to, you have to be more willing to show. Now when you sing, let's see what you do. Okay. That's too soft. Too soft? Too, yeah. How's that? We can't hear it. Can't hear it. Oh, gosh. Um, it, it is all the way up. How about... Try it. Let's see. I'll cut you back if it's too loud. Is that, right? is that good? <laughs> I gotta rewind it. Okay. That's not loud enough. Not loud enough. Um, can I hold it here? Better. Okay. Oh. 
louder um i can put it closer to my mic it's as loud as it gets maybe that'll work okay don't get behind the piano and don't get under it you've got to be over it what is your opening dynamic what is the dynamic marking in the score forte is that your forte it, it can be louder i can do more forte i think it can Pianist okay. is a little slow. Let me just check the tempo, just so you know. Where'd my metric? You're muted again. Excuse me. Okay. It's gone, right? Yes. Oh no, I could I could hear you before. There we go. Now I'm gonna click this out of my out of the way. Let's see what the pianist does. Let him start again. Okay. Okay, stop, stop. He's too slow. Mm. Okay. He's got a da dum bum ba dum. He's too da dainty, or she, whatever it is. Can you sing without the piano? Sure. Da dum di da da da. Take that breath out so you can't slow down so much. Okay. okay. Keep going. Listen. You go anytime. there you didn't start start in the tempo in the in the beat of the but you kept the tempo <laughs> now here's the beat it begins right i'm in the right place so you're not you're not feeling this can you feel that in your body yes your R, your R shouldn't be uh, it should be horizon. Use, use the Italian at R. Okay. Don't, don't say horizon like Eddie Piaf. That's not good for melody, okay? Okay. Listen, Sydney, listen to this tempo. Oh, gosh. Can I get you to stop breathing in the middle of that phrase? Uh, yes. Oh, my gosh. Mark a phrase mark. There's no breath there. It's not long enough. It's not, this phrase isn't long enough for two breaths. Okay. Keep going. Oh, you came in too soon. Sorry. Okay. You got to count the rests. Okay. Let's begin the bar of O Rapido now on the downbeat. This okay. is one. Oh, happy to... 
Sydney, look. Mm -hmm. It's one, look at me. Look at me, Sydney. One, two, three, four. I'm doing it left handed. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. It's good that you're conducting, but do it, do four beats. Okay. Start one, two, three. Oh, gosh. Oh, happy. But Blair, you gotta give me that you gotta give me that screen every time because I can't do it on my own screen. You hear me? Sorry now I'm muted. Um uh, sorry Tom, I don't know why it keeps muting. I don't understand why you keep getting muted, to be quite honest. Well, it's probably something to do with my computer's old as the hills. I don't know either. But now I'm now you can hear me. Correct. Okay. I can't do it I can't do much more with you right now. What am I trying to get you to do? Express. Tell me, tell me give me some feedback. Uh, express the emotions, the intent of the dynamics. Do me a favor. Once a day, break a dish. You don't, you don't let your emotions, I'm not criticizing you, okay? I'm making an observation and I don't know you even, but I'm going on what, what you show me today. You're too reserved for this song. You don't have to sing the song. Maybe it's the song's fault. Maybe it's not meant for you. You probably need a more lyric, lighter song. Let's see if I could give you, you know what might be a nice song for you to sing? Um, do you know Renan Doan? H-A-H-N mm -mm. is the composer's name. Okay. And the name of the song is A Cloris. Okay. A is just A. Cloris is C-H-L-O-R-I-S. Mm -hmm. Okay. It's a very easy song to sing. I mean, I didn't say to find. And that would suit you better because it doesn't make you sing dramatically. You're, you're very young and so is your voice and you're not really ready to sing this song. You know when you go look in a window of a department store and you see a beautiful outfit that you want to buy for yourself. But guess what? It's not for your body. It's not going to look right on you. You're either too thin or too heavy or too whatever. And so you need to choose clothes 
that are going to flatter your body just the way you want to choose songs that are going to flatter your voice and fit your voice try to find your own try to find things like oh and to think of another foray song chanson d'amour okay by for by foray um Bonsoir of WC. You sing that already? I had I have sung that one, yes. That would fit you. This is a song for a mama 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 mezzo. You're not a mama mezzo. I'm not criticizing you. You're sweeter than that. You're more lyric than that. Okay? And I won't ask you how old you are, but you're very young. Yes? Yes. That's good. Oh. Don't ever change. <laughs> Just grow. Huh? Okay? Okay. Thank you, Sydney. Thank you. You're delightful. Thank you. Thank you, Sydney. And we're moving on to Jose. Uh, I'm going to unmute you, Jose, and hopefully, or ask you to unmute, rather. Boy, I hope I don't keep going on mute like that. It's a drag. You may, you may be hitting, you, it sometimes happens if you hit the space bar by accident. So maybe that could be it. Oh, really? Okay. I don't think, I, oh, anyway, I thought I was hitting my mouse. <laughs> or, or that. <laughs> oh, this is my favorite song of the afternoon. This is Jose. Coming up. One moment, Tom. I'm trying to see. Uh, Take your time. Jose, are you able to unmute? I thought it looks like you are still muted here. No. You, I did unmute, and then I accidentally muted myself, and then oh, I had okay. to unmute myself. We're all having the same mute problem. Hello, Jose. <laughs> Hello. Hello, Maestro. How are you? I'm well. Where are you from? I'm from Los Angeles, California. Where were you? You were born in Los Angeles. Yes. Have you heard people say Los Angeles? I've never heard Los Angeles. I've heard Los Angeles or Los <laughs> Angeles. <laughs> You're, are you a baritone? I'm a baritone, yes. I hear it in your laugh. <laughs> okay, this is a very special song. What can you tell me about this act? This song is what? It's one of three. Yes, correct. From a cycle or a group, whatever you prefer, called the promenade, the, the walking of the lovers. Mm -hmm. Yes. Who is the poet? Um, the poet is... Oh, you've got to look. Oh, that's not a good sign. I know. I, <laughs> I just don't want to... Uh... Why oh, yeah. is it important? Let, what, let me. What Please came first? Me. What came first? The words. Please Prima la parola. Uh, <laughs> okay, I love the way you laugh. I hope you use that in your in your singing. Thank now, you. what is the what is the century of the poet? Uh, the century. In don't guess if you don't know. Okay. It's surprisingly early. I don't know. I can't say with 100% certainty. Tristan Lermite is the early 17th century. 17th century. It's Baroque poetry. Ah. Very early. It, you know, most poetry that, that melody composers uh, write songs to are from the 19th or 20th century, mostly the 19th. Mm. This is two centuries earlier in the first half of the 17th century. It's very stylized. Baroque poetry works with especially conceits, which are opposing forces like hot and cold. Mm. And that's the case in this song. Didn't you find the text a little enigmatic? Yes. 
Yeah, because I mean, there's there. I do see. I I noticed the, the deceits with, um, you know, you're trembling with desire, but you're afraid of the, the forces. So, it's, and then at the end, it's like make me above human, so so I can. It's very. It's it's very. It's very enigmatic. What's the metaphor here? He says, "I tremble when I see your face floating with my desires." What do you think of right away? I'm aroused when I think of you. No, when it floats. What is the? What's floating? What floats on water? Uh, flowers. No. That's... What do you get into to float on water? A boat. Oh, right. <laughs> I'm not being subtle here. Okay. I want you to, I want you to take the subtlety away. Okay. I, I tremble upon seeing your face floating with my desires. So afraid am I that my size don't make it capsize. Ah, okay. Faire naufrage is when a ship is a ship has a shipwreck. Right. But I okay. like the word in English capsize. You know, it goes, it goes it's nose first, it goes down. Iconic. Yeah, but not quite as dramatic as that. Right, not as, not as dramatic. You go, I tremble. Oh, okay, yes. I tremble when I see your face flowing. Okay, now, it's Jose, right? Yes. You, you say Jose Luis? Jose Luis. I think that's a good combination. Maldonado, what does that mean in Spanish? Maldonado, I mean, directly translated, it's badly donated. Yeah, badly given. <laughs> yeah, badly, badly given. given. But, it, but it actually is from Salamanca, Spain, and it had to do with treasures. Has to do with? With the treasure. I see. I never knew that. But I always noticed that name. It has a real meaning. Um, don't just read it to me like a grocery list. Don't just, I tremble when I, you know, don't do that. What is the expression? How do you feel about this person? I tremble. What does that tell you? That I am I am smitten by this person. No, I'm that's not the right not, not, not the word I want. What are you when you tremble? Scared. All right, that's a little too strong. Nervous? Nervous. Yeah, you're a little anxious. Anxious, nervous. Upon seeing this 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 face floating with my desires why because i'm afraid that read on i'm afraid oh yes uh so much do i fear that my size may cause it to sink so my size represent what my what are the size for for admir uh, to admire <laughs> admiration what do, what do they represent? With the boat or in my field? Oh, with you. Oh, it's uh, my my expressing myself to this person. My, my, my words, my my. My desire, my sighs from my 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 desires. Yes. Make you sigh, and you're afraid that's going to what? Ruin it. Scare her. What was that? Scare her. Scare her away. Okay. You're coming on too strong. I'm too you, strong. You oh, like, like, uh, like, some, like the song, Something Stupid. <laughs> then I go and ruin all by saying something stupid like, I, okay. Yeah, that's what it is. Yeah. <laughs> Don't you see? You, 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 you got to hold yourself back, but you still feel this powerful emotion. And that's yeah. why it's such an intense song, because you're containing... You want to take off your coat? Um, sure. You don't got to be all dressed up. This is a working session. So you're afraid that your size are going to make the boat that her face is represents shipwreck, capsize. Go on, de crainte de cette aventure. De crainte de cette aventure. No, no, in English or whatever. Ah, yes. For fear of this hazard, do not trust freely to this certain element all the treasures of nature. What does all that mean? You rattled it off. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what you know what it means. Right. Um, 
So if it, it's like, hmm, that it, it, it's what I feel it's is so much like, it's like a follow the text. Stay with the text, but okay. For fear it, of this it. hazard of shipwrecking or scaring I her off, I have a better word. Let me help you. Let me help you. I think that that's what that Mr. Belknock uses as well. Right. Mm -hmm. This adventure. This for fear that this um, event event um, uh, uh, un unexpected. This unexpected. Event may not commit so faithfully, mm -hmm. so freely to this uncertain element. What is the element? What are the four elements? Oh, uh, water, fire, air. Here you and... go. What's the what's the element here? And earth. Um. Wind. Oh, this Come on, you're, on, you're in a boat. Water. <laughs> I'm you gotta stick to the <laughs> water. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> For fear that this ha this unexpected event doesn't commit so freely to this affidel. It sounds like a word that would mean unfaithful. Mm hmm but here it means undependable. Mm, undependable. This undependable element that is water. That is water. That it would commit to this undependable element all the treasures of nature. And where are those treasures to be found? On the ship, her. There. You looked up at the ceiling again. You keep looking, the ceiling not going to tell you anything. <laughs> okay? Okay. I've got to help you here because it's very difficult. It's difficult. It's enigmatic poetry. Yeah. Quite an enigma. Would you, would you buy a, I can say the word sweet here, a sweet privilege, place me above the rest of men. Now this is the hard one. Yeah. Allow me, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Allow me to drink in your cupped hands as long as the water doesn't dissolve the snow. Yeah. Where did you get the snow from? Iceberg? I'm thinking ship now. Um... No, don't forget her. Her cold, her cold yeah, heart, yeah. her cold her, heart, her coldness. coldness. She's distant. She's reserved. Ah, ah. she's not easily obtainable. You're, 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 you're the pursuer, and she's the pursuee, mm. and she's so the pursuee that she's like this. And you're, you, you go, you say, I got to be careful because if I come on too strong, she's gonna go. Ah. Mm. Okay, yeah, that makes so much sense. Yes. You feel what I mean? I feel it, definitely. So it's kind of a admission of intimidation before this beautiful creature that it seems to be floating on water. And you don't want to, and you don't want her to um, let herself depend upon this trust, this untrustworthy element of water that would save her, maybe endanger all her beauty. But would you, wow. would she, by a sweet privilege, would, would she really place me above all other mortals? Do you want to be, do you want to be placed there? Yes. What do you want from her? What do you want from her? Her love. Her. Give me another word. A real in this situation. What is she being? Cold. So I want her. She's up, being up distant. Up. She's being oh. distant. Hmm. You want her to be. Welcoming. Uh, 
inviting. More intimate. Very intimate, yeah. Intimate, mm -hmm. that's the word. There we go, I'm back. Okay. Now let's sing. You understand the poem a little better, right? Yes, yes, thank you. It was difficult for me. I worked on it all week. And I, the first, I've worked, I've played this song, I performed it. By the way, these three songs are the favorite three songs of all the repertoire of Pierre Bernac. Oh. It's important you know that. Very. When we had his, the, the memorial at Manhattan School of Music, the, the year of his death in 1980, the, the memorial tribute, we had these songs played on amplifier with a big photo of him on the stage. So we just heard his voice and saw his face. It was so effective, I remember it now. The audience was overwhelmed because he really likes, he likes these songs. Oh, we have to work with the pianist again. Oh, <laughs> is this an app? No, 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 um, uh, no. This was recorded um, by my good colleague, uh, Chao Gun Go. A real pianist, a real live. Pianist. Yeah, we, we, we talked it and she, she did the recording for me. Chinese? She's Malaysian. Chao Jungle. sorry, not Gungo, Jungle. I hear you. Let's go. All right. Jose, Jose, yes. the piano's too soft and you're too loud. Oh, oh, yeah, I can change that. Let me. This is a duet. Yes. This is not a, a big solo for you. The piano is as important as the voice in this repertoire. Let me move the speaker closer to the microphone. Is this louder? Yeah. Okay. Is there a mute on the piano? No. Um, let me try. I have a backup. Try this. It's hard to be spontaneous with this, isn't right. it? Thank you. Je tremble voir ton visage flotter avec mes désirs. Let's get rid of the piano. Okay. We can't hear it anyway. No. Oh. Find a sound. Don't go away. Okay. I'm here. I want you to find a sound. You're giving me that baritone, dignified baritone sound. I'm not making fun of you. I want you to see what I mean. Okay. Are you going to be dignified when you're talking to her here? No. <laughs> what are you going to be? What are you going to show? How are you going to be? T tender, careful, um, loving. Go ahead, more, more. Um, intuitive. No, no, don't just make it up. What do you? How do you feel talking to her? Well, I'm I'm nervous. I'm anxious. Good. I have a desire. You're you're vulnerable. Mm, very vulnerable, yes. 
you're not going to be like this. You're not going to be like a preacher. You can't sound like a preacher. That's the way you're doing. You're, you're singing in your baritone. You're noble, very noble, nice sound. You're a little tenuous. You're a little, you're not sure of yourself. I tremble when I see your face floating with my desires. How about no breath between visage and flotte? Okay. So that we do it in one breath. Je tremble voi à toi Wait, wait, stop, stop. Je tremble voyant. Look at that tempo. That's the tempo. Oh, it's not in the score. Damn. That's not even the right tempo. Wait a minute. <laughs> Boy, this is difficult. Isn't it? Yeah, it's hard. Yeah, I was, when I was working with the pianist, I was like, "Ah, oh, let's just Gerard Suzé's tempo." <laughs> let's try this tempo. Je tremble voyant You go. Je tremble. Start with the metronome. Start with the metronome. Choose one of the beats to come in on. Yeah. No, 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 this there will there, there, there will be a delay with your metronome sound and my receiving it. Yeah, so I, 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 I was going to say that too. I can take your tempo good. and then internalize it. But I won't leave the metronome on. I'm sorry, I didn't know that. This is so different for me. Oh my god! <laughs> I'll play it and then I'm going to stop. And then you come in in that tempo. Je tremble à voir ton visage flotter avec mes désirs. Yeah, because you don't keep the tempo. Listen, get mm. it in your body. I'm not going to leave it on. Okay. <laughs> But listen. You got it? Got it. Je tremble voir ton visage flotte avec mes désirs. Tant je ne peux que me soupir. Tant j'ai de, tant j'ai de peur. Triple again. Tant j'ai de peur. Tant j'ai de peur. Don't slow down for the triplets. Ah. You're the fourth singer today. You are the fourth singer today. I pretty much say the same thing to all of you. Tell me, Jose, why do singers always slow down? What is it, a suicide pact or what? What are you people, <laughs> what are you people doing? Why do uh, you all do, what is it? Is it because you're listening to yourself? No, I mean, part of it, if, also since when your hand's moving to conduct, I'm, it's also- I'm awful. not conducting, I'm being good. I'm being okay. quiet. Because I, I was trying to look away. You're doing it all by yourself. Okay. And you were doing it with the piano. You were shutting the piano out. You've got to choose a tempo. I don't care what the tempo is. It says, reversement long. What does that mean? Where? I'm sorry. It's at the beginning of the song, the marking by Debussy. Uh, long, así, lento, muy, uh, medio lento. Uh, What is revisement? Like. No like. Pero, <laughs> um, What is rev? Après un rev. The song that we just, the tenor sang. After a dream. Mm. Dreamily slow. Dreamily slow, okay. Not you know desperately more morbidly slow just a lot floating slow 
It's got to be like speech. Don't just draw. Don't become like you're making a speech. Okay. You're speaking intimately with someone you really desire and feel for, and you don't want to scare her. Okay. Again. Je, je tremble voyant ton visage flotter avec mes désirs. There you go. Go on. Quand je ne peux que me soupir, me ni face faire un naufrage. Three, one. Le crête de cette aventure ne commet pas. You came in late. You can't come in late. Okay. Frage. Three. One. Jose. One. Je crains. It's the eighth note. It's a full eighth note. Ah. Frage. Three. One. And. Ne commet pas si librement à cet infidèle élément tous les trésors de la nature. Okay. Make a deal with me that you're not going to breathe. Okay. Until, until librement. Okay. You've got the breath. You've got good lungs. So you sing, what's legato? Tell me what, I did you listen to the other singers? We just worked on what, what is legato? How do we sing vowels in French? On the... And consonants? Vowel, legato? How do we sing vowels, long or short? Long. Long vowel, consonants have... Semi-consonants. Semi I think you said semi-consonants? Semi Consonants. Um. Consonants rapid, rapid and clear. Listen, rapid, late, and clear. Tell me back. How do you sing the vowel in French? Long. How do you sing the consonants? Rapid, clear, crisp and clear. The most important one is late. Late. Don't don't anticipate the consonant. Don't let the consonant eat up the vowel. Okay. Especially in a wordy section, de crainte de cette aventure. You got to sing those short notes, and not don't speak when you sing. Okay. Even if it's parlando, this is parlando style. Mm -hmm. But don't it, it's not a conversation. Okay. It's on the voice. Got to be sung. Je uh, de crainte again. De crainte de cette aventure ne commet pas si librement à cet affinant le monde tous les trésors de la nature. say how old are you 31 i feel a certain maturity in you so i want you to try to match that in your approach okay take this more seriously it's not a drinking song mm -mm. <laughs> i don't think you think that but you're giving me that impression okay. let me intone the french for you so that you can work on it okay okay Je tremble en voyant 
voyons. You hear what I'm doing? Not voyons. 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 Je, je tremble en voix. Voyons ton image. Oh non. Ton visage flottir avec mes désirs. Ton G2, tu es ton G. Ton G. G. Ton G de peur. Quand j'ai de peur, look at me. Look at me. De peur. De peur. Same vowel. In those two words. I start again. Ton j'ai de peur que mes soupirs ne lui, lui, say for lui. me. Ne lui. Look at me. Ne. Ne. Open your mouth. Ne. Oh, of course. That's schwa. Ne. 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 De peur. De peur. De is a schwa. Peur is the noe. They're the same sound in French. Mm. Okay. Sing the the the, the schwa. Ne lui fa. Go ahead. Ne lui fa. Go. Oh. Ne lui fa. Why slower? Why slower? Ne lui fa se faire un naufrage. That in the in the in reality, don't come off your voice on the F. Don't sing it in falsetto. Try to mix it more. Okay. When you sing when you sing the phrase really with the piano, you go into a falsetto on the F. You know how to mix, don't you? Yes. You need to mix more there. Keep okay. going on. Mm -hmm. Schwa. De crainte de cette aventure, ni comme pas, ni comme pas. De crainte de cette aventure. Stay in rhythm. Don't get slow when the notes get shorter. Okay. De crainte de cette aventure, ni comme pas. Look, one. De crainte de cette aventure. Nature is tied. So don't say ture. Mm -hmm. don't, don't syllabify the schwa there. Do you see the tie and the two yes. P double flats? De cette aventure ne commet pas de crainte. De crainte. De crainte de cette aventure, ne comme pas si librement. I have an idea. How about no breath until librement? Ah, si, si. In this new tempo, you can do it. De, de crainte. De crainte de cette aventure ne comme pas si librement à cet infidèle élément. Yes, but à cet infidèle are sixteenths. You're singing eighths. À cet, inf à cet infidèle. Don't keep changing the da pa pa de cette aventure ne comme pas tu tu ne comme Okay, 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 I'm stuck. Tu ne commets pas si librement. Sing it in time. Okay. Don't change the tempo constantly because the values are perfectly written by the composer for the language. You don't have to change them. They make the language sound right. Okay. Have faith in Debussy. He's a good composer. Yes, he is. <laughs> De Crin. De crainte de cette aventure ne commet pas si librement à cet infidèle élément tous les trésors de la nature. Wow, you realize you sang, you sang those phrases all together? 
we didn't we were allowed to, it's okay that's ideally what should happen ah okay that's very nice now we're beginning to hear your voice you're singing more you're not speaking mm, yeah it, it, there was definitely a, it's, a flow it's, to it it's like a singer not like a like a preacher right <laughs> the two five minutes tom you suddenly get slower when you got shorter notes so you lose track of the tempo virtue one more time Veux-tu par ton privilège Notice lege is tied. Yeah. Don't syllabify. Okay. Veux-tu par un doux privilège And mm. you're going to breathe there instead. Okay. Veux-tu par ton privilège Breath. de me trop des uh, I stopped saying doing the French for you. That's what I was doing before. Ah. Listen to this phrase. Me mettre de dessus. It's a schwa. And Le then, de si. and then, de, look at me. Desima, ma. Desima, ma. Excuse me, ma. You know why, you know why that happened? Because you're singing in your nose. <laughs> Desima. No, this isn't pretty. Desima. Desima. Ma, ma. Desima. Look, oral, pharyngeal. Desima. Listen, does this make sense to you? The yawn. Mm. Put the nasal in the yawn. Ma. Ma. Not ma, but ma. Ma. Get it here. In the ma. Sense that you so you have a little. Ma. Open. That's a boy. Ma. Mm. Uh, one more time. Me mettre de. Me mettre de si. A triplet shouldn't take longer than a beat. Right. Me. Just making it up. And when you do it with piano, it goes crazy. Mm. Me mettre de si. Me mettre de si des what are the two basic rules of singing? I'm sorry? What are the two basic rules of singing? Breathe <laughs> on the breath. Oh, no. First of all, think, think the pitch. Open your mouth. <laughs> open your mouth. You're singing like this. Now, is that part of your training? No. I think opening your mouth is not a sin. Right. You can do it too much. But let this let this be space. There's got to okay. be more space. Your voice is so naturally rich. You got to give it place to re resonate. Okay. Don't Thank contain you. it. Me mettre dessus. Me mettre dessus. No, 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 it's not dessus. It's de de. 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 Oh, left a more soir. That's a schwa. No, why do, you, why do you hold it? Why do you hold it four beats? What's the answer? Because it's a higher note. Don't go off your voice in the higher notes, okay? Okay. You're muted, Maestro.
Thank you, Blair. He helped me that time. <laughs> now, don't change the sound for the higher okay. note. Just stay with the same resonance if you can. Okay. Don't subtract the, the meat of the sound. Okay. You don't want it to be louder. I respect you for that. But mm. then don't let you don't stock it either. Okay. Why do you change the tempo? What are you what are you doing here? What is your tone of voice? Let me drink in your yes. cupped hands. Yes. How are, you, how are you speaking to her? Allow me. Allow me. Mm. Yes. Give me a word. Um, what are you doing? How are you talking to her? Um, not plead, pleading. Um, I think so, yeah. Yeah, yeah you're, you're requesting. Mm. You're asking, let me drink in the cup, in your cupped hands. If, however, the water doesn't dissolve of your um, of your um, hands, yes, no, yeah, the the snow, which is a metaphor for the coldness or the distance. She's a mm, very right. reserved lady. Play a B flat. B flat. Where's my piano? Okay. What happened to you? It's the old pitch there. Long oh, that's good. Right. <laughs> you weren't singing that note. C low. Uh, Excuse me, Jose. Yes. It says retenu. What is retenu? It says retenu, right? Yes. What does that mean? Um, in Italian, ritenuto. Ritenuto. Uh, yes. When it says ritenuto, is it suddenly slower? No, no, it's no. It's got to happen gradually. It's a long time to the very end. It says ritenuto, and then it says encore plus retenu. Yes. Even more ritenuto. You got a long way to go. You're not going to get blue in the face. <laughs> right. Si lo. I'm sorry, Tom, we're, we're nearing our end, just an FYI. We're, we're finished. OK. This is the last couple of notes. Si lo no ti you a higher baritone yes <laughs> now i want to know i'll be finished in a minute blair why did you choose this song i love the song but why did you choose it um this this was so i i got this song years ago but i, I never um tell never, me why you chose it i i chose it because i love i love the i love the song i love i love the lyrics i like the music I, and Don't forget the story that I told the young lady, I think it was Sydney, when you're looking in the window uh, in a clothing store and you see an outfit and you mm. say, I'm going to buy that outfit. Maybe it's not a good outfit for you. Right. Sing songs, sing repertoire that flatter your voice, that use your voice, that fit your voice that are easy to sing in your voice. Don't choose songs because they make your voice go lower or higher, at least for public consumption. No, I mean, uh, to th this piece specifically has a lot of, it's, it's, it's definitely more of a tool because I've, I've learned a lot. Um, what have you learned? I mean, for, for one, <laughs> for one the, the different, um, like the F singing on the pianissimo, staying on the breath, and it's, it's, um, for me, it's it's helped me with connecting, um, 
the, the text with the tessitura. I've seen a lot of different tessituras too. So, uh, of course you do. Everybody has to. I yeah. want you to also, when you think about your singing, to make your singing connect with the emotion and the intent and the dramatic delivery of the of the of the phrase not technically mm. you have to think technically I, I, I understand but for you're muted master it's still muted I didn't do it. It was Blair's fault. <laughs> My computer told me that. Try to make yourself think about what you want to express. Mm, okay. Don't think of what register you're in or what you um, should do or shouldn't do vocally. Think about that another time. Mm. Don't start thinking that way. But think subjectively. It'll make you more expressive. Okay. And you're old enough to do that. You yeah. have the years to do that with. I'm not saying you're old, but you're mature. Mm. So you, you're, you're in your young maturity. Yes. Use that. That's a good thing to have. Okay. Thank you. Good, good luck to you. Thank you, Maestro. Thank you, Jose. You're very welcome. And uh, we have one singer left. Let's see if I can bring her up. Maria, Maria. unmute. There she is. I'm gonna. I have to get her name. Maria. What? Maria. Maria. Hello. Aren't <laughs> you a breath of fresh air? Oh, thank you. <laughs> everything the dre the dress and everything that goes with the cheeks. Yes. What are you going to sing for me? I'm going to sing Fleur Jeté by Fauré. This is. Excuse me, I'll turn around. Oh, terrific. <laughs> okay. That's called a Tom. I did a Tom. My brother's watching. I hope he's still watching. That <laughs> means that I lose things because I hide them on myself. Oh. What kind of song is this, Maria? This is a very dramatic, non fore like song. It's a Gibbon song. Yeah, it is. Isn't it? Yes, it really is. It's not a dainty song. There, what it, is? It goes, and there's no stopping. It just goes. What is? What does Phil Jeté make you think of? What character in opera? Ooh. Who throws a flower? I don't know. Who throws the flower? Carmen. Oh, Carmen, yes. Okay. <laughs> she throws the flower at Don Jose. Have you seen Carmen? I've been in Carmen, yeah. Oh, were you Carmen? <laughs> no. <laughs> You're one of those ladies. Yes. Which one? I was just in the chorus. Oh, okay. Jose is sending a thank you to everyone. Just to let you know, it just came on my screen. Let's read the text. What does the title mean? <clears throat> Fleur jeté means discarded flower or forgotten flower. Thrown. Thrown, okay. Thrown flower, yes. yes. Okay. Discarded is not really the point. It's thrown. Carry away my folly at the whim of the wind, flower plucked while singing and discarded while dreaming. Bear away my folly at the whim of the wind. Good girl, good girl. That's expressive reading, go on. Piano. Like a scythed flower. No, it's a piano of anger. Okay. Like a- You know when you, ah, 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 and then you, ah, 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 ah. You know, when you grit your teeth and don't grit your teeth to sing, but you know, when you quiet down, it's even worse okay. when you're angry. Go, come a la fleur. 
like a scythed flower. Love. Yes. The hand that touched you shuns my hand forever. Good for you. Go on. Like a scythed flower, love perishes. The hand that touched you shuns my hand forever. Like a cut flower. I know you said scythed, but who says that? That's in the um, the the translation that Blair gave me. <laughs> I know it's a weird. It's not a word that anybody's going to understand. Throw me under the bus, why don't you? Oh, I. <laughs> I no, mean, but but uh, but just as you know, this isn't in Belknock's book, so we had to go hunting for an alternative translation. What did it say in Belknock's book? Uh, no, it's not in Belknock's book, so we had to look for an oh, alternative okay, right. translation. Yeah, like so a we, cut, like, yeah. A, like yeah. a cut down. You know what a scythe is? Yes. It's one of those. You, you cut the wheat with it. Yeah. It's violently cut. Mm -hmm. It's not snipped. Yes. So, yeah. like a cut down flower, perishes love. Mm -hmm. I think you turned it around. Did, did you mean that? Perish, well, either way, yeah. Perish is love. Yeah. Peri l'amour. Go love. on, Lama. Uh, the hand that touched you shuns my hand forever. Yes. May the wind that withers you, oh poor flower, so fresh just now but tomorrow faded. May the wind that withers you, oh poor flower, may the wind that withers you wither my heart. What is the feeling? I, anger. And I mean, it's very tumultuous. And what else? Anger and worse yet? Bear, sadness. You're bitter. You're bitter. bitter. Okay, bitter. <laughs> You're angry, bitter. Angry, bitter, okay. You're not in a good place. No. <laughs> but I like the way you read because you give me, you give me um, energy. You give me, that's good. I knew the minute you appeared. <laughs> good. <laughs> How are we going to do this? Let's see what the pianist does. Yeah, let me, let me play just, just the piano to make sure it's loud enough. And then we'll go from there. It could be louder. Okay. What? What was that? Is that loud enough? I don't hear anything. Yes. Good, because that's as loud as it goes. <laughs> you could bring that closer, maybe. Where's the micro? Where's the microphone? That's better. Let me see if I can get this to stay. Don't let it fall. Okay, is that better? Good. Okay, let's just forget about the piano. I can't hear anything. Oh, ah, shoot, okay. What is this whole stanza going to be basically? What dynamic, uh, how are you going to sing? Because the next stanza is the piano. What is this whole stanza going to be just about? What dynamic? Forte. Let's that. keep it simple. This is not a subtle song. Oops. Okay. <clears throat> Maria, there's times for subtlety, and there's times when subtlety is not appropriate. This is one of them. I'm. You're angry as hell. <laughs> okay. Start over. Yeah. Forget the piano. Stay on time. Now let me make corrections quickly. Yeah. Oh, Paul, let me make corrections. 
Mm -hmm. Or Paul de Matoli. I wouldn't say folie or o. I would tie folie. Don't say the schwa. Instead, on porte ma folie au gré du vent. Okay. You see what I did? Yeah, I think that was probably inadvertent on my part. I've got it. That's what's written, written but it doesn't sound e e o. It sounds awful in French. Okay. I'm going on. The word is fleur. Look at me. Fleur. Fleur. Don't say fleur. 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 Uh, are you are you from Hawaii? Um, I actually I lived there for twelve years. I just moved back to the mainland to Oregon, so I was yes. <laughs> You're West Coast. Yes. You people don't use your lips. <laughs> okay. Fleur. Fleur. Rounding, Maria, rounding is fronting. It's not. It's not that. It. Okay. Fleur. There you go, you got the sound. Fleur yeah. enchantant, cueille, crescendo. Et je, c'est jeté. Jeté, et jeté, yeah. Je. Je. Make schwa like the fleur. It's the same vowel. Et jeté en rêvant. Et jeté en rêvant. Et jeté. Et jeté en rêvant. Et jeté. Et jeté. Don't spread your lips apart. I maybe did that in front of you. Don't do that. Okay. Don't do what I did. Et je t'ai en rêvant. Et je t'ai en rêvant. 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 You see the little hat on the E of rêvant? Mm -hmm. That means it's an open E. Yeah. You, you, ten, you tend to say, sing rêvant, which is not a word. Rêvant. That's okay. a girl. Oh, porta ma folie, oh, great. This time, do you see the E is elided? And yeah. you sing, li, oh, great du vent. Mm -hmm. Let's begin again. <clears throat> oh, porta ma folie, oh, great du vent. No. Oh, porta ma folie, oh. Li, you learn li o. Li o gre, okay, got it. Don't say li o, say li o. Cross that out, that e. Okay. E. Uh, got it. <laughs> but don't don't interrupt the sound. On porte, on porte ma folio. You say flair, like a flare pen. Same I hear flare for fleur. 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 Oh, don't move your lips all over the look. Fleur. Fleur. Just leave them alone. Okay. Don't change the position of the vowel. Fleur en chantant. Fleur en chantant. Fleur en chantant. Fleur. 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 You've learned flair. You've learned flair. You don't realize it yet, but you, you'll hear yourself back. Yeah. You've learned flair en, flair en chantant. Fleur en chantant. Fleur en chantant. Fleur en chantant. Fleur en chantant. Open your mouth. It's not a sin. Fleur en chantant. Don't, don't. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay. I like you because you do too much. <laughs> okay. It's easy to cut back somebody who does too much. It's hell to get somebody who does too little to do more. Okay. So you're an easier person to work with because you're an overdoer, right? Usually, yes. <laughs> That's a good thing because okay. you can cut back. Go on. En porte ma folie au gré. Excuse me, have you learned folie? Open O. Folly. Folly. Fol. Fol. No, not, we're not going back to the beginning. We're no, just I, yeah, yeah. Look at me. Oh, porte ma folly. Oh, porte ma folly. Oh. Oh. Dark A nasal is open O nasal, okay? 
Okay. Or por, like por. All por, the, the match, they're matching vowels. All por to my folly. You open your mouth too late. Okay. All por to my folly. All por, por to. All por to my folly. All por to my folly. You don't understand what I'm showing you. You don't okay. energize all the vowels as short as they may, they may be. They've got to be equally energized. En porte ma folie. En porte ma folie. 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 Like instead of, okay, I'm trying to think of it. Don't say folie. Folie. Fo it's folie. Folie. Fo. Fo. Au gré du vent. Good. Go on. You want me to sing or just say the text? Go on with the French. Comme la fleur. I want to get the French right. Okay. Comme la fleur. Look, look at me. Look, this, the basic position of French is this, Maria. Not. That's American. That's the way Americans talk. They don't use their lips at all. Mm. And you're from, you say Oregon, though, don't you? Oregon. I say Aragon. <laughs> Isn't that terrible? No, nope, I hear it all the time. <laughs> no, but you must get tired of that. But otherwise, I, I round my lips more than you do. Comme la fleur fauché. You go. Comme la fleur fauché. Is full closed or open? Full is full. Full. What's that? Close. No, 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 Come la fleur go. Come la fleur. Do it in time. Come la fleur. Come la fleur. Fauché. Peri l'amour. Excellent. Go on. La, la maquita. Don't do that. Don't sing in your nose. I worked on that vowel with Jose. Look at me. La ma. 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 Not ma, but ma, ma. You see where I am? Mm -hmm. ma. La ma. La ma qui t'a touché. 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 You notice the word, you notice the, the E flat on touché is tied? Yeah. Don't syllabify the schwa. Okay. I know what you're thinking, but it's syllabified in the score. You're thinking that, right? Yeah. Typesetters can't read music. <laughs> okay. You see the tie by Fauré? He doesn't want it syllabified. Okay. La ma qui t'a touché, go. La ma qui t'a touché. She. 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 Put more E in your E. More E. She. She. No, she. She. You're going she. 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 Think of she. She. Think she. 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 Think more e, okay? Don't say she. It's really too American. To she. To she. Good girl. Go on. Fui mama. Fui mama sans retour. So. So retour. So. So. Open O nasal, not dark A nasal. Okay. Oh. Every dark A nasal becomes open O in singing. Son. Son retour. Son retour. Go on, it repeats. Comme la. Comme la fleur fauché. What, what, what? Fauché. But faux, faux. Faux. Okie dokie. Come on, la fleur for share. You do this. Look at me. Okay. 
Yeah, make fun of me. Make fun of me. Okay. Fushi. Fushi. Voila. Okay. Come la fleur fushi perila. No, it's tied. It's tied. She. Sorry. Uh, she. Don't you see? You can't trust. Don't trust the typesetter. Trust the composer. Okay. He'll tell you how to syllabify. Peri l'amour. Peri l'amour. Go on. La main qui t'a touché. Oh, come on. It's tied. It's still not. She. Ugh, sorry. It's hard to. I got to I gotta break myself of that habit. It's gonna be... Yeah, but it's there in the music, isn't it? Yeah. Got to read the score. La fleur, la main. La main qui t'a touché, puis ma main sans retour. Are you going to break that phrase when you sing it? No. So why did you break it there? Keep going. La main. La, la main sans retour. No. La main qui t'a touché. Sorry. La main qui t'a touché, puis ma main sans retour. Okay, you got to get rid of ma. Get rid of this. Look at me. Uh, hate, hate this. Ma. Ma. Isn't okay. that ugly? It is, like, yes. <laughs> ma, ma, ma. Ma, ma. 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 Yeah. Don't sing here. Okay. Quand un Français parle, I know you're not going to understand what I'm saying. I want you to hear it. Quand un Français parle, il ne parle jamais dans le nez. Don't sing Sans in the nez. No, when the French person speaks, he doesn't nas nasalize the way Americans talk like that. You know what I'm talking about? Mm -hmm. Always here. <clears throat> French like, oh, oh, oh. Yeah. Oh, oh, in the yawn. Yaw, okay. Incorporate the yawn in your resonance in French, especially for the nasal. Go on, que le vent, vent, open our nasal. Que le vent qui te sait. No, 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 vent. Vent. Not, not vent. Vent. Que le vent. Open our. Vent. Look at me, Maria. Vent. Vent. That's what I want you to sing. Not vin, vin. It sounds like wine that you drink. Okay. Que le vent, like, yeah, que le yeah. vent. We should sing it in rhythm and with que le vent. Que... Sing on the pitches, sing on the pitches now to the end. Okay, let me get my piano. <laughs> no, forget the piano. No, no, I mean just the note, just the note, sorry, not the piano. Da, da, da. I made that up. Up there in the top voice, you could stand some rounding. Not va. You sing va. I hear V I N. Okay. Que le vent, que le vent. Que le vent qui te séche. All right. I hear you now. You sing séche. It's séche. Okay. It's open. Yeah, I got it written in my IPA. <laughs> yeah, but you didn't use it. I know. Okay. IPA, if you don't use it, it's no good, right? Correct. You're very funny. I like you. <laughs> how are you going to sing that phrase? Are you going to try to separate between sesh and o pauvre? I thought it was a good idea because there's a comma, but I am open to not doing that. If that's forget that. the comma, okay. make believe. Can you see my score? Can you see what I've done to the two B flats? I put a dotted tie. Okay. Make believe that even if you sing sesh o with a restart on the o, you don't sing sesh o. That's not pretty in French. Okay. So sesh o po. Okay. All right. So I got to get, I got to deal with all of these schwas at the end and get ready. Well, are you going to syllabify them? He's not consistent. You see there, he didn't put a tie. Yeah. He yeah. should have, could have, would have. 
Sesh o. You can stop and start again. Oh, okay. Okay. To make it more dramatic. Yeah. Que le vent. Que le vent qui te sèche o. No schwa. Que le vent qui te sèche o, pauvre fleur. Finally, sèche is opening. You've learned sèche. It feels you know like the way people say crepe. Crepe. They say crepe Suzette. Crepe. It's crepe. Sèche. 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 Let's go to the end now. Que le vent. Que le vent qui te sèche, oh pauvre fleur. Maria, my, my dear. Yes. Don't say sèche. Say this. Sèche. Oh. Sèche. Cross out the syllable, the E. Yeah, it. I don't even realize I'm doing it. It's cr okay. It's crossed you out. You have to realize it to fix it. I know. Okay. Okay. Done. Que le vent qui te sèche, oh pauvre fleur. Good. Go ahead. Oh. Tout en heure si fraîche. Open, open, fresh. Open. Why are you closing all those E's? They're open. Fresher. Fresher. Tout à l'heure. si fraîche. Et demain sans couleur. Very good, you did that right. You didn't say the schwa. Yay. <laughs> now, did you see the way you sang the word fla, the, the word couleur? Did you see how you sang couleur? Did you notice you opened it up? I didn't, but that's- I know you didn't, but that's the right vowel. Okay, Love. In the middle and low voice, you close them down. Okay. So, que le vent, que le vent, oh, qui te sèche. Oh, well. All right, que le vent qui te sèche, ô pauvre fleur, stays open. You mm -hmm. see where I went back to? Yeah. Yep. Tu, tu ta, look at me. Tout à l'heure, si fraîche. Much more open than you. Tout à l'heure, si fraîche. Che. 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 OK. Sure. <laughs> Et demain sans couleur. That's the one you do right. Okay. So couleur. teach yourself to do the way you do it right on leur. Leur char. Go on. Que le vent. It's all the same words. Que, que le vent qui te sèche. My dear Maria, uh, don't, uh, don't honk on okay. the nasals. Bon. Don't honk. Okay. Vol. Don't sing in your nose ever. Okay. You can add resonance in the front, but sing in the above the nose in the eyes. Que le vent, vent, vent. You hear that? Yep. It's not French. It's an American idea of French yep. nasality. Yeah. So they, they do the nasality the way Americans do in their everyday speech. You know what I'm talking about, don't you? And how can I like that? God, I hate that. Even people that announce on TV, mm -hmm. they hired people to talk in their noses. What's that? Okay. You don't talk that way in your in your English, do you? No. No, don't do it in your French. Okay. And finally, que le vent qui te sèche. See in the next phrase, it's big syllabification on yes. the schwa. Yes. And then a big tall vowel on the high A flat. So, uh, nice vertical. So, so, but don't spread, just keep it vertical. So, 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 so. You know what's good about this song is a lot of the high notes have the OE or the schwa or the open E, mm -hmm. which gives you space to sing in. Yeah, yep. You're delightful to work with. I like working with you. 
Thank you. I, I'd like to see you again sometime. Excellent. Thank you so much. <laughs> Are you going to go back to o Oregon? I'm actually in Las Vegas right now, but then I will be going back. Oh, to <laughs> I spent two summers at UNLV. Oh, nice. I'm just do you, busy. Just do you know who Carol, you know Carol Kimball is? I know, yes, I know the name. I've never worked with She's her. One of my best buddies. Oh. She studied with Pierre Belnac when I was there. So, and you know her books, don't you? Yes. Yep. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Maria. Thank you, all singers, all of the work that you did today. Um, tough work that you did today was beautiful. It was wonderful to watch. So thank you for uh, putting yourself out there and keeping yourself open um, for a big audience today. So thank you. Yes. And above all, thank you, Tom, uh, for this amazing class. Uh, it was just wonderful to see you working again with singers. It's been over a year. So welcome back. <laughs> I'm glad we've had you back, yeah, even though it's virtual. Everything's been over a year for all of us. We haven't done anything in a year. I know, I know, I know. Well, we look forward to having you back uh, at a live class at Manhattan School of Music, but thank you for working with us virtually. Um, you know, technical glitches and all as they arose, um, we certainly hit them out of the park. We, de you know, dealt with them and got I you want, back to working with us. I want singer. to speak to Misun, who just sent us a message. Message. She's a pianist from Manhattan School. Misun, hello, my dear. Thank you. <laughs> and Samantha and Laila Barnat. I know that name. Merci infiniment. Are you French, Laila? Yes, she is, yes. And yes. thank you, Blair, for organizing this so nicely and helping thank me. Thank you, thank you, Tom. And thank you all for joining us today. I know it's been a long but wonderful uh, afternoon. I will be sending up follow-up materials uh, from today, with, uh, including the recording. So anyone who wants to go back and listen um, you know, more acutely to some of the recommendations, you will certainly have that along with an excerpt from Belknap's book that um, Tom wanted you to have uh, from the first chapter, the performance and interpretation of vocal music. So we'll have some other things in there for you too. But again, uh, thank you for this wonderful afternoon and for joining us. And please stay tuned for the Summer of Song Festival series. Um, you can check our uh, website or social media or write to me personally if you're interested in singing or having a singer take part. Wait a minute, uh, I've got to say goodbye to people that are saying goodbye. Linda yes. Walker, Grace Hackett, uh, Misun, then uh, Jose, Barbara Rierick. Oh my goodness, how nice! She's a, I'm getting teared up again. She's a student from Manhattan School from the '70s. Sahoko is here. Oh, and Benita Valente was watching today too. Wonderful. Leticia just said goodbye. Thank you so much. Oh, I'm Thank getting for clap. <laughs> <laughs> Well, of course, everyone came out to see you at work. It's, uh, as let I say, them, let, them, let them send their wishes. If we can. Yes. Oh, no, no, we'll keep going. Uh, we'll keep going. I'm going to just shut the recording off, but uh, you can continue. Let, to, them, let uh, them just do the flash on their. Absolutely. Absolutely. Okay, they've stopped.